back to the video. Guys, for this video, and I, I gotta say something before we begin opening the uh, flare pack, booster packs of baseball, baseball cards. If you guys remember the basketball card video, you'll know I pulled two Michael Jordan cars, cards. Okay? Those Michael Jordan cards, $15,000 each. Got, you guys look it up. Um, the, it, you look up the Flair 1990 Michael Jordan card. And you'll see on eBay, people are selling them for $15,000. So, I have two. I'm $30,000 richer today. It is amazing. This day cannot get any better, and I'm super happy right now. I really am. But, guys. That's what we're opening today. The Flair baseball cards. So... Yeah, this is it. Today's video. Oh. Huh? So, these packs come individual, individually wrapped like this. So in the first pack. That's so cool. Huh. Look at that guys. That's really cool packaging. So cool. Like these, really, I gotta go show my dad. This is really cool. That's awesome. Dad, look at this. So, I have to look up something real quick. Why I'm doing it on camera, I really don't know. Okay, I had to look up if Derek Jeter uh, played in 1993. So apparently he was drafted by the Yankees in 1992. So therefore, yes, he was playing in 1993. That's the card I want. The 1993 Derek Jeter. 
That's the card I want. I, I still can't get over how cool that packaging is. But uh, yeah, let's get into it. These are gonna be really annoying to open up. I'm definitely gonna have to split this one. I was actually, to be honest with you, I was just gonna do it one video, but I might have to split it up. My God, it's just the way that they're packaged is amazing. I don't want any other player. Hey, Dad. What was another really good player in 1993? Besides Derek Jeter. Do you know? Okay, he did answer. Derek Jeter, please! Yo, uh, th the way that these cards feel, it's so... So like I'm even the video's already seven minutes. This might be an hour long video of pack opening. Well, who cares? So like, here's the thing, I'm being really careful now because of how much that Michael Jordan's worth. So like, I'm being super, 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 super careful with what I touch here because it's like, like I didn't know, like I got Larry Bird, I got Magic Johnson. And it's like $30,000 isn't something that you get every day. So that's why I'm trying to be really, really careful. Hey, Dad. What other uh, really There's good... There's a lot. Just open up the cards and we'll go through them later. Okay. Yeah. As I said, I'm going for uh, Derek Jeter. It's really the only one I want, to be honest with you. I was a really, I, I love the Yankees, Mets, all the Mets fans out there. Mets are garbage. I hate the Mets. I hate them so much. But, um, um, when Derek Jeter used to play, I used to always watch him. They have some pretty decent, the Yankees has, have some pretty decent players. Aaron Judge is pretty good. Not pretty good. Aaron Judge is really good. Uh, DD is really good. Oh, uh, Gary uh, Sanchez is really good. Pretty good. I think that's his name. I'm just not sure. But I remember how interesting games used to be um, when uh, Derek Jeter was playing. Like, it was interesting. All right, we are on our fifth pack. Go. So 
here's the thing. If I do decide to sell my card for $30,000, no, I'm wrong. One Michael Jordan card is uh, 15000 So I have two of them. I could get a nice new scooter with that. I know you guys are probably like, why, why a scooter? Uh, for those of you who don't know, I love riding trick scooters. I love it. It's super, super fun. So, am I not going to get a Derek Jeter? Like, for real? How have I not gotten a Derek Jeter yet? I don't understand. If I really don't, I might start crying because I really want Derek Jeter. And guys, can we just appreciate the packaging on this? Like, please. This is amazing. It's really nice packaging. Like, if you guys look at some Pokemon card packaging now, compared to this, and this was in 1993, you gotta remember that too. So, for people back then to be making nice packages like this, it's a disgrace. You go to uh, Dick's, and when you're paying for whatever you bought, like your cleats or something like that, and you go to the front desk and you see uh, all the cards, it's literally just um, like the little plastic wrappers. This is amazing. This is awesome. Wave to the future. Guys, please leave a comment down below if you think that I'm going to get a uh, Derek Jeter flare card. Because I know he's playing right now. I mean, not right now, but I know he was playing in 1993. I just looked it up. So to get that nice golden flare Derek Jeter... Be pretty sweet. Before I open this real quick, let me look, let me look at what it said real quick. Derek Jeter was born June 26, 1974, New Jersey. He was drafted by the Yankees in 1992. So yes, he is playing. So I, I just gotta hope I get that card. So, like, with basketball, I know what rare cards I got. Right now, I have no idea whatsoever what, I got, what I'm, like. Again, this is from 1993. I was not born. I was born in 2007. So, I wouldn't know. Uh, if you guys want to see, like, a video, like, a huge recap on everything, like, every specific name of the card... That I got, I will post that for you guys. But right now, that's the rarest card, Derek Jeter Flair. So, so we were pretty deep into the box. Actually, who am I kidding? We're not even near deep into the box. There's still a lot of cards left, a lot of packs. So this is a look for 20 different Wave to the Future. Ah, so Wave to the Future cards are the rarest cards. And we just got a lot of them, so let's go. I didn't even realize that. All right, guys. So now I know what we're looking for. We're looking for Derek Jeter Flair and Wave to the Future cards. And this is a 200, uh, not 200, 300 uh, card set. Hey, we got another wave to the future. Let's go. So yeah, I'm, I'm just good. So there's 20 different wave to the future cards. 
All right, so now I have like something to actually like look forward to getting. So yeah, I want to get all 20 of the 1993 Flair Way to the Future cards. Okay. What's going on? Why isn't that going in? Please. Thank you. Wait, like not going in. Alright, so maybe Derek Jeter is a way to the future card, because. So maybe he is. All right, so if he is, then we want, well, I want Derek Jeter, classic flair, and then I want Derek Jeter, uh, what's it called? Then I just want Derek Jeter, wave to the future. What's this? Ah, checklist. All right, so we got our first checklist. Okay, so we'll just keep the checklist. No wave to the future on that one. Again, like I said in uh, what's it called? Uh, the basketball opening. If you guys want to see more, God. if you guys want to see more old uh, card opening videos, make sure you guys don't go down below and hit that like button and comment if that is what you want. Because I could definitely get more if that's something you guys are interested in. Saying you do. I'm glad I'm making videos like this because I feel like with like my my, my Minecraft Let's Play, I feel like I was just like a gaming channel now, and that's not what I wanted to happen. And uh, well, it didn't, so that's good. Cause like I really didn't want that to happen. Cause then it just gets boring, you know. It's like. Okay, you've been doing the same thing for how long? Let's see something new. So like the the trip out here and everything like that, it's a little more interesting. What do you guys think? You think it's more interesting? I think it is. Still, when I get home, I will be doing the Minecraft Let's Play. Uh, I'll be doing it with uh, Wild Joe. Check him out. Wild Joe. I will be doing that with him. Uh, go give that guy support. He really is uh, a good YouTuber. He has his own Minecraft Let's Play that he's doing. I don't know why, but sometimes there's cards like this. Where it's like the, the picture is sideways. And then there's cards like this. But... Like, why? So, no, so far, no way to the future cards at all. Well, I not 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 uh not at all. So we got we have a couple. We've had a couple. Let me read the back of this real quick. It says, "Look for twenty different wave of the future limited edition suspect cards. Some of the brightest stars of tomorrow. Odds of finding a limited edition car are one out of four packs." Okay, so I have four packs. 
how am I supposed to do that math to find out if you're going to get a wave of the future? I I'd love to know. I guess you pick out four, four packs and then the fifth one would be a wave of the future maybe? My math is probably off by a bajillion. But anyway, there is six wave of the future. So basically like... Dang it. So basically, like, with, um, what's it called? With the basketball, there was, um, what is it called? Was the Flare All-Star cards. So that was their, like, thing. And with this set, it's, uh, the, what is it called? The Wave of the Sea cards. That's what it's called, right? Wave, wave to the future. Duh. Guys, we still haven't pulled that Derek Jeter. Come on, man. Just show up. Please, bro. I don't think he was on any different team besides the Yankees. I don't think. I could just be making that up. But I do. Hey, we got a wave to the future. Can you, can you sit there, but look how glary it is. See that? Uh, Mike Paisa. That's so not how you pronounce his name, but I'm going to call him Mike Paisa. Okay. I'm making like a little, uh, like a flipping period over here. Pyramid over here. It's nuts. And if you guys want to see some really old baseball cards that I have, well, they, they were my, they're, they're my dad's, but if you guys want to see them, like, I guess I can show them to you. I have one of his binders in my room, so I could show you that. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys, like, the artwork. Because the artwork from, what's it called? From, like, really far back then is so much different than um, artwork now. And remember, this stuff is in 1993, and it looks so good. Like, just, just let me show you guys. The premier set, the unique set for those with a special flair for the game. I just... None of my dad's cards are like this. They're like... Oh, God. They're a little creepy, to be honest with you. Like, look. Look at this artwork. That's just some random guy, but it's like... Oh, God. It fell. Ah! Okay, I got him all. So... Maybe Derek Jeter isn't in this set because he was new to the game. That, that could be possible. Probably not, but maybe. Hey guys, leave a comment down below. If you guys collect baseball cards, is that what they do? Like, players that aren't that good, they just don't put them in on baseball sets? I mean, I would assume that he would at least be a wave to the future card because, I don't know, was he even good in um, 1993? Maybe that's why they didn't put him in wave to the future because he was just an F player. He wasn't that great. I don't know. Baseball fans, leave a comment down below. Is that one?
We're not gonna get a Derby here. I think this is actually the last row of cards. Right here, the last four. I think. Could be wrong. like hey it's not the last layer let's go you guys want to see like uh i don't know like newer pack openings or do you guys just want to see like uh like old school pack openings because old school sets aren't that expensive it's the cards that are expensive and if you find somebody on ebay that like has no idea what he has and he's just willing to give it to you a little messed up but you can make make some good you can get some good content off him hey we gotta wait to the future let's go wait to the future as you guys can tell by the hat i am a huge yankees fan i know i probably already said that love the yankees I should have actually wore my uh, basketball hat for the basketball opening and then the uh, baseball hat for the base this baseball opening. I think I'm going to take, like, one of these packs and I I'm going to keep all, like, really rare cards in here. Like, all my really rare baseball cards in here. Because some dope packaging, boys. much plastic. Yeah, we gotta wait for the future. Let's go. I know I don't have him. Maybe these cards are like... Alright, so here's my theory on why I don't think any of these cards are gonna be rare. I don't think any of them are gonna be rare because... But I'm, so, I'm starting to get the vibe of these are really good players of baseball and then really good upcoming players of baseball. So maybe just the wave of the future cards, maybe those are the only ones that have some value to them. But this set in general, I don't think is going to be worth a lot simply because of that. So real quick to show you guys that it was sealed. This is on here. It went to this. Just to show you guys that it was actually sealed fully. Not that it really matters too much. What is this? Hmm. Like double artwork. <laughs> oh my god, it's like double art artwork. Like him batting and him catching the ball. Or something like that. I don't know. Come on. Let's hope we can pull at least like one more wave, wave to the future. How many? Alright, so we're real close to the end here. Real close. To the end of the pack opening. Okay. Okay, this is the last pack of the second to last row. I got a 30 minute video, my God. I'm kind of wishing now that I did the basketball uh, card opening in one video too. I'm getting so many Gary Sakan. What? 
thought that was Gary Sanchez. I'm like, oh, what? Still no Derek Jeter. See, I told you. That's what I think it was. I don't think that Derek Jeter was any good in uh, 93. Either that or he's simply just... Oh. Either that or he's simply just a wave to the future. Guard. That could be, but... Also, guys, uh, before I do end this video, I want to see how many Wave to the Future cards I got. So, uh, I definitely will tell you guys in another video, probably not this video. Because I just want to get these uploaded and it's going to take a while for me to uh, go through every single, uh, what's it called, every single thing. Oh wait, is this your first one opening? No. Uh, I opened all of them. No, 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 no. So you opened all of these? Yeah. Can you put them back in here? Yeah. Can I open them? Watch what? Watch that one. I'm just gonna do this by myself, okay? Okay, then. You'll be in my next pack opening if I do another one. It kind of looks like a pyramid almost. Hey! That's it. You got, you got it. Shh. Okay. Yes. Wave to the future. Another one. Who's that? So the wave of the future cards are the rarest cards. And gotcha. I just pulled some. Alright, we got one wave to the future. So what I'm guessing is maybe there's like one wave to the future on uh, every single um, like layer of cards. And I think I was like, what, six layers? So maybe I got six Wave to the Futures? No, because I know I got way more than that. All right. So my theory is wrong. No Derek Jeter. You guys want to see, like, Pokemon cards? I just had a curiosity, like... Like, because I have so many, like, things I've never opened. And, like, I, I never knew what to do with them, but that's something you guys want to say. I could probably make that happen. Last two packs. Last two Let's see, box is empty. So, you can just see what happened. Pretty good bad, uh, box. Alright, let's see if we can get one more way to the future. I'm so tired right now. Oh. So, if you guys remember, there was a video where I tried to tell you guys my embarrassing hair dye story, and it never really came out right. Something happened. So I'm just going to tell you guys now while we're doing this. So as you guys know, I was trying to dye my hair blonde, right? It was blonde, and then what happened was I, like, overdid it. My hair turned orange. That's just, that's just a good way to like sum it up. Dad. Out of every single thing I open, I haven't found one Derek Jeter. How is that possible? Okay, guys, last pack of the flare huh? baseball cards. Can we go away to the future? Maybe.
It's something I do to like say maybe I can get a rare card. I, I do that with Pokemon cards though. Yo! It worked! We got a wave to the future! Let's go! Yo, what are the odds that my trick worked? Dude, what? Let's go! So wait, how many did you open? All of them. Okay, so you open one, two. Huh? All right. What are the odds that our last pack that we opened, we get a wave to the future? Pretty good. All this right. kind of looks like a pyramid, right? It's supposed to be. Wait, are you trying to make a pyramid? Well, yeah. Sorry. All right. Oh, gosh. Let me show you guys real quick. Why am I so tired? I swear, opening uh, cars gets you a little tired. Um, I'll just show you. Here's the carnage from it. I hope, like in the basketball video, my uh, big thumb got in the way. I hope this time it doesn't. That's the carnage, that's the box, and this is like the little pyramid thing I made. I don't know how many guys can see that. Box. All right, guys. Um, in a future video, I will be sure to tell you how many way to the future cards I got. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be it. If you guys want to see more card op pack openings, I will be sure to do that. See you guys all in the next one. Let's roll that outro. Peace.